All right, next letter. This is from MK, first and last initial, Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. Another Canadian from Manitoba. Um, has a little track that he made here. A pretty neat one. There's the thing there. Do you consider yourself a good person? To be a good person? And you go to the end, says, inside and it says, the Bible says, um, of course, Isaiah 64, 6, James 2, 10, Romans 6. Well, okay, I'm, I'm mixing, I'm seeing some of the verses there. A bunch of different verses, you know. I'll kind of bring it back this way a little bit so you can see the whole thing. Then on the back, a couple more verses of Scripture. And there at the very bottom is my website, kingjamesradioministries.com. You can see there. Uh, again, print this type of thing up on your own computer. It's a good, good idea. Um, but now the letter here. Okay. Hello, Brian. First, I would like... To like to say thank you for responding to my letter in your two-part video answering questions. I hope you and your family are doing well. I'm sorry to hear about the attempted robbery at your home. I'm glad and thank God you guys are safe. Um, that was a while back when I had the secular channel, the off-grid channel thing. Um, the reason I'm writing this letter is because I have enclosed a gospel tract that I made and would, I would like to know if it's okay with you to put your website at the bottom of the tract. Absolutely, anybody can do that. It's the first one that I made, and it's a rough copy. I plan to use trifold glossy brochure paper for the good copies. I don't have a website, and I think it's a good idea to have one, yours, there, on there to point people to the truth. I'm not sure if you're okay with that, so I thought I would ask first. Yes, absolutely. Anybody can put my website on their things, so not a problem. Um, also, I have an Instagram account that I use to post monthly Bible verses. If you are interested in checking it out, um, gives his username there. Also, I just want to tell you of a wonderful blessing the Lord has done for me. He put it on my heart to start memorizing Psalm 119. I'm at verse 145 of 176 at the moment. It's been a tremendous help and such a blessing, hiding God's Word in my heart. In Christ, M is the name there. So... That's quite an undertaking. Psalm 119. It's uh, what you would call the biggest chapter in the Bible. I realize it's a psalm, but, you know, it's a lot of verses. So, And it's all about the, the Scriptures and the Word of God. Hmm. Kind of puts into perspective what matters a lot to God, His Word, His written Word. So, yes, uh, anybody can put my website on their tracks. That's fine. Um you don't need my permission to do that. I give anybody permission to do that. That's okay. Um, so thank you for your letter. We'll go on to the next one. 